Hello and welcome to FM Review. I'm your host, Freddie Robinson, and in today's video I'll be going over the Delta Children's Sweetest Beginnings Bassinet. Inside the box you get a canopy, a bassinet fabric cover, a mattress pad, a storage basket, a mattress support, top rail frame, four support legs, four casters and screw assembly, two basket support tubes, assembly instructions, and a music box. Step one is locate four support legs and four casters. Insert casters into the bottom of the support legs and push caster in until you hear the click. Pull on each caster to assure it is properly locked in place and repeat for the other legs. And here you can see the hole in the bottom of the support leg and you can see the caster where the hole is filled. And now you can hear that the click has taken place so this is securely in place. You just go ahead and repeat this step for the three remaining legs. Step two, locate the top rail frame. Lay the top rail frame on the floor with the support leg inserts facing up. Step three, locate the four support legs, identify support legs labeled A and B, align leg A with leg support insert A. Insert the support leg into the support leg insert and push the leg down until you hear it click into place. Repeat the other steps to finish. And here you can see where A is labeled on the rail frame and A is labeled on the support leg. So you'd match these two together and push them down until you hear it click. And here you have this little spring loaded peg that would lock in place. And now you just insert this in until you hear it click. And repeat this for the other three legs. And once you have all four legs in place, make sure you have these facing inward because that's where the support will be and that each one of these are tight. Not going to fall out. And for the next step, you will turn this over and locate the support where it says this side down and then you would lay it inside and line up the holes and the next step would be placing the eight M4 screws into the holes holding the support in place and for these screws you could use either a flat or Phillips screwdriver Step six, locate the two basket support tubes, insert and fasten the M6 screws. Repeat on the other side. And here you can see the hole in the support tubes and you do have the M6 screws that will go between these. Make sure you do leave one side unscrewed and that way you'll be putting this bottom tray fabric on those tubes. And here you can see that this opens up and slides over those tubes providing you with an area for storage. And now you can put the two remaining M6 screws into the ends of the tubes. For the next step, you'll locate the front of the bassinet and you'll take the screws out of the music box and place them to the, through the two screw holes. And here is a closer look at the music module and you can see that there are hard buttons with volume control and different melody controls. You also do have a light and on the side you can see where the volume or the sounds come out. On the back side of it, you do have an area that holds four AA batteries that you will have to provide. Keep in mind the way that this works, it will be placed toward the front of the bassinet and in order to change the batteries, you will have to remove this to get to that back panel that does screw into place. And now that the batteries have been put in place, you simply just run these screws through the holes and line them up with the music box.
The next step will be placing the bassinet fabric cover over the frame. Place the liner into the frame. Make sure the warning label is centered at the end of the bassinet. This is the end where the warning label is and that will go over the end where the music box is because you do have an opening here so you can access these hard buttons. Underneath this little side area of the bassinet cover you do have these snaps that needs to be opened up in order for it to lay over the frame. And now you just take these two snaps and snap them over the frame and this holds the fabric cover in place. And you can see that there are two snaps on the very bottom that does hold this in place in addition to the ones that go around the frame. Next you'll place the mattress pad inside the bassinet. And now you can go ahead and attach the canopy. Inside this cloth there is a slash opening and that's where you will attach the hardware to the frame. And this is what it's going to look like. This will snap over the metal bar of the frame and hold it in place. And you do the same thing on the other side. And the very back area is elastic and that will go over the frame on the back end. And here's what the canopy looks like once you have it in place. It is adjustable and you can hear these clicks that lock it into place. You can have it all the way down or you can raise it all the way up. And now we'll take a closer look at the music box. On the very top you do see you have a plus and minus volume button. You have two different buttons for songs and you have a button for a light. And now you can see what the light looks like once it has been turned on. And you can get a preview of what the songs are like. Freddy thanks you for watching the video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to keep more awesome FM reviews coming your way. Earthling. Three, two, one. Action. And here you can see what the light looks like once it's turned on.